Yeah. Well, it's the morning after. We had a pretty good, a pretty damn good day, a pretty damn good evening yesterday. And uh, I just want to say thanks. Just want to say thanks to uh, to Scott and Sarah for a great night in the old owl house down in Truro in deepest um, Cornwall. Really good night, thoroughly enjoyed it. Didn't enjoy driving home in the uh, tiny little back lanes though. <laughs> anyway, we've got to go and get some breakfast. I'm just waiting for Lizzie, because she's going to get the car. Yeah, look at this thing, look. This place that we stayed in is a, um, it is a, a spa. Unfortunately, the actual spa treatments weren't available, so but we never got to use anything anyway. Oh, this is already started. Here we go. At least the sun's shining and the weather is good. Ready? She's up. So we're lost somewhere in um, we're lost somewhere in uh, Cornwall at the moment. When we talk about lanes. These are little lanes. said um she wouldn't want to be on her bike right now and i'm like nope this is steep full of moss wet terrible in the uh winter time bloody hell Look at this. We're not 
sure whether this is land or sea or what. Bright sunshine in Cornwall. Beautiful. They're all rednecks, my family and America. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> They're all rednecks. My last name's Hill. Indiana. It's Hillbilly. <laughs> or Buckethead. <laughs> yeah, they were good people, though. They're really, they really good They're people. They're salt yeah. of the earth. Yeah. You know, yeah. 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 right. There's so many more better rides. Yeah. Uh, you know, Virginia, they got the, the snake pit. There's a drive there. Yeah. You get out to, to Montana, Idaho, and just do these roads. Yeah. I, Sturgis, I think you kind of go on and you're kind of like, okay, I'm here. And then morally, there's a part of you like, eh, it's not what I'm into. It would, it um, would literally be us just having a look, wouldn't it? And then yeah, we, to then say, we go on to say, yeah. I've and, been there. And, yeah, get, <laughs> get the sticker. Get a t shirt. <laughs> but, but really, there's so much country. Um, yeah, I know. We And, and we ride, and yeah. most of our buddies, we. We'll just get a place and we'll go do this loop 80 miles around or yeah. up in the mountains and stuff. Get away from the freeway and just ride. Yeah. I'm not a big uh, pub to pub to pub to pub. But just no. go for a ride. And yeah, yeah. We like take that. Take in the scenery. Yeah, yeah, just take it yeah. in. Yeah. Do you have music on your bike? See, I don't even have a radio or anything on my bike. I'm you know mine's what? old school. I, I, I just sing. Huh? I just sing. sing. <laughs> I used to I used to have bikes that had everything on them. Yeah. And then a few years ago, didn't I? I thought, no, I am fed up with this. I've got a bike called a Royal Enfield Interceptor. Yes. You, you, you know it? Yes. It's a, it's a modern retro bike. Lizzie's got the same bike in a different colour. And we and it's got nothing on it. It's just bulk standard. Yeah. Standard speedo. Just that's it. That's all. That's all you need. And do you know what? It's really refreshing, it's fun, isn't it? Isn't it? Really it's refreshing. It, it gets you back to why you enjoy the bike and why you're riding. Exactly. A lot of my buddies have got the dressers and full-on dressers and stuff, but and then they got the radio so damn loud. And I said, I'm riding the bike to hear the bike and hear the sound. Exactly. Smell. You, know, you know, if you want the radio, drive yeah. your car. But I get it. I mean, everybody. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's it's personal preference, but I think it's very distracting when you got all that in your ears. Because we used to use it. Well, I mean, I used to use it to just chillax. Yeah. That sends me. That's my happy place mm. where I just chill out and I can be me and all the pressures of life. And do you know what I mean? They just all disappear as soon as you get on a bike. Just get on and go for an hour and then come back and you're yeah, happy. Absolutely, absolutely. Thank God. God. And then our shoulders get back like. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> yeah. My bag gets caught and I'm stuck there. She's going. What are you yeah. doing? Bye bye. We just walk away. <laughs> You're what are you doing, damn it? Yeah. What are you Still doing? It's embarrassing me. Uh, Time she ignores me. <laughs> so I gotta almost get tased. If you taste me, you better have breakfast because I'm chubby. You'll smell. I'll smell like bacon, and you'll be really hungry. <laughs> I'm 
I saw some police officers the other day. Oh, did you? I go, hey guys, I go, you got tasers? And they're like, why? Like, oh shit. Like, no, I'm joking. I'm a chubby guy. I just want to make sure if you tase me. Wait for oh, me. So yeah. Right? Then the police turned up. Right? Thanks again, Mike. Enjoy the rest of your time. No, anytime. Take care. Good luck with it. Yep. You'll do fine. You've got the right spirit. I've got it. I know it. I know. I'll do it. <laughs> Going through a tunnel. Oh. Why aren't we doing a tunnel? Oh. Yeah. I thought we was going through the. Um, hold your breath, Liz. Ready? Steady. Lizzie and I have come to Arley Davison in uh, Plymouth, have a look around, um, trying to decide on new bikes that we're having, so we thought we'd have a look at the Harleys, you know, not saying that's what we're going to get because there's a Triumph dealer around there as well and uh, we might, we might go in there. Hey. Good, thanks. Is it alright yeah, right if I keep my camera on? Make you famous. <laughs> you make me famous then, yeah. Why are you famous then? Just because you are. <laughs> That's what Bogan was on, wasn't it? Low rider ST, fast running, yeah. Yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? It was 2000 per model, we're lucky enough to have that one. That's an outline of the store at the moment as well. We saw one the other day up at um, near Lincoln. Peterborough. Hmm. We've got one in Peterborough. We've got our road glider as well, which is just behind you. Which actually looks much better with the lines.
looking at the slightly older street bob and uh, they've got one here in black which is quite nice it's 10.99 it's a 2018 One of the things Lizzie and I love doing is just people watching. <laughs> we just watch everyone, don't we? Lizzie's watching the bikes coming past. A couple of motorbikers. There you go. People love to ride up and down the front. And Sidmouth has been a very special place for us. We've really enjoyed the actual town of Sidmouth coming down to it. We haven't had a lot of chance though because we've been so exhausted through work. Just going, don't get time to come down here properly, do we? I'm in a bit of a chilled 
Yeah, yeah Liz is chilled. Anyway. Let's uh, take in the atmosphere. We keep going places and say, do you know the Barnet Bikers? No. But they love the name. Yeah, everyone loves the name, but we don't know the people. Well, there's only two of us. There is. It was three, but one one It was three, but he, he's gone. He's, he's gone. gone off. He's gone off with his girlfriend. He's gone. Don't want to be a biker anymore. Oh, he's still a biker. He's just, um... Well, to be fair, he kept his bike. He's still, he'll always be a Barnet biker because you're in by blood, aren't you? Yeah, I don't like that. Oh. Just cut all that out. <laughs> 